Hey you guys, I'm Tiffany and welcome to Our Organic Life. Today, I'm putting ketchup in my pony's mane and tail. I read something on Facebook recently that kind of intrigued me. It was um, someone had left a tip that you could whiten a horse or a pony's mane and tail using ketchup. Now, um, if you watch our vlog um, or follow us, you know we have a white pony named Penny. And she is, we use her for pony rides from my mom's company and she's also my son's barrel pony. Now, maintaining a white pony or horse can be kind of a hassle, especially when they're out on a large pasture. Now, her fur is totally fine. It's nice, it's white, it's bright, but the mane and tail tend to get brassy, dirty, stained, and it's not, it doesn't stay bright white very long. Now, we normally use something, I think it's called shimmering lights, and it's a purple toner shampoo. And it works pretty good, but it, it's expensive. And so we kind of try to use it sparingly, but I'm, if this works, you can get ketchup for so cheap. This is gonna be such an awesome thing for us. So today we're gonna experiment with that and we're gonna put ketchup on our pony. I read that you don't wanna use it on their skin. You only wanna use it on their mane and tail because for this to work, you have to let it soak for 15 to 30 minutes. And I think because of the acidity, it can cause skin irritation. So you only wanna use this on the mane and tail. So disclaimer there, only on the mane and tail, not on the skin. So as you can see, she, well, that's her skin. She has black skin, but so let's go from a different angle. So as you can see, she's white. Her fur is great. It's nice and white and clean, but her tail, now of course we color it for the pony parties from time to time, but it's got hues of tones of purple. And then as you can tell against a white, it's, it's yellow. And especially at the very bottom, oh, you feel, hold your tail still. So, yeah, but at the very, so at the top, you've got, we've still got some purple from one of our recent party bookings, and then it's yellow compared to the rest of her, and then, oh, she'll hold it still, at the, oh, 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 oh Penny, Penny, hold it still, oh, oh, and she's gonna just wait, but at the very bottom, you can see that it's, it's just, it's dark, it's not white, and then, her mane's pretty good right now, but it's definitely yellow next to her, her fur. So we're gonna go ahead and for good measure, just go ahead and do both the mane and the tail for the experiment. Okay, so the way that you do this is you gotta just, you basically just lather ketchup into their mane and tail. And we've got her all, her, her mane and tail are nice and soaked, um, but you soak it for 15 to 30 minutes. Um, and like I said, mane and tail only. So we're gonna go ahead and start lathering up her mane and tail with ketchup. Should be interesting. All right, that is a ketchup soaked tail. Now for her mane. I'm sorry, baby. I'm sorry, baby. <laughs> Does this smell funny? All right. Okay, and now we, uh, do you want to taste it? Mmm, yum. <laughs> Does that taste good, Penny? Are you gonna clean my hands up for me? <laughs> so now we uh, set a timer for, uh, I think we'll go ahead and do, I mean, let's try the, 50, the 30 minutes. Let's do the 30 minutes. Let's see how white this gets her mane and tail. All right, it has been 30 minutes and this is what it looks like currently. Very uh, ketchupy. Hopefully we don't have a, uh, red tail when all this is said and done. 
but I'm hoping that this, I mean, if this could work, that'd be awesome. I mean, it might not work, but we will find out. So let's wash her up and see how it looks. All right, so it is the next morning and because her hair was wet, so I couldn't really see, but it's dry now and it is the next morning. I did have to wash with soap the ketchup out. It wouldn't come out, of course, so you do have to wash the ketchup out with soap. Um, there's still a little yellowing, but at the top, if you notice, it's, it's very, very white. And her tail, I'm actually somewhat pleased with her tail. At the top, it's still a little yellow. Um, but at the bottom where it's normally like really, really yellow, it's actually lighter. It's not like tremendously lighter, but it is lighter. Um, so I wonder if maybe if I saturated it more, if it would have come out more white, or maybe if I would have let her sit and soak in the sun, maybe that would have helped. But, um, I mean, it's not as good as shimmering lights, but it, um, I mean, it didn't not work. So try this at home. And let me know what you get.